good morning you guys thanks for watching another episode we're taking some pictures tomorrow and so um we're just gonna see if we could find an outfit or so i don't really like the matchy matchy outfits but my husband does um and he's kind of taking over christmas when it comes to decorating the house and i think he's trying to take over these christmas picture so as long as everybody looks kind of cute um and their faces look moisturized i'm okay but yeah like i said we're just trying to find some outfits for tomorrow i didn't really find anything in marshall's or raw's um we're gonna we might try coles they don't usually have much but we might try them <laughs> old navy i heard does have like a 50 percent off sale so we will probably go in there um but that's it it's a beautiful day to be out and about i think it's like 70 degrees today so we'll probably end up going to the park after um their bikes. taking the kids to ride their bikes after we do a little and bit more shopping scooters. and scooters well, because one doesn't really oh so okay so in our neighborhood we live on the main street in our neighborhood and so it's really not safe for our kids to be riding a bike if we lived on an off street or in a cul-de-sac it'd be okay but on the main roads you know the cars just be coming around and there's curves and everything just be going too fast so our kids don't really get to ride their bikes that much and the only time they get to ride them is if we load them up in the truck and we go to the park so aubrey has rode her bike like two or three times this year she honestly just got her training wheels taken off this year or last year this year this year and she's rode her bike a couple times and she's picked it up like and I there's was, been like a huge was, gap in between i was trying to like push and so i would push and i was trying to paddle and when i was paddling i started looping and, it was and then she and just picked I her feet and put them up on the pedals and kept going so she did really well jordan's doing really good on her bike too she just needs to use the learn how to use the brakes she uses her feet as brakes and it's a little bit wobbly um but she'll be fine I in london too, but i gotta practice using them and then um i gotta practice my bone but then the people because i'm trying to get the hang of like i yeah. can get off the thing but you just need a little bit more practice and you'll be a pro yeah but i'm um, pro at bike like paddling and everything and i ain't got all that stuff yeah she's much better at that and it's really awful like if we lived in a neighborhood we grew up riding bikes, but our neighborhood just is not conducive to bike riding. No, it's just not safe. Just, people just drive all crazy, and you know they're on their phones. I don't have time for my kids to get hit. One, two, I don't let my kids out of my sight, so you're not riding to in the street and coming back. My eyes have to be on you. So we don't live in that kind of neighborhood, um, and we don't even have sidewalks, and that is just like beyond me. Like, why would you have this nice neighborhood? And not have sidewalks like why did they not think of that um but yeah so the only time they get to ride their bikes really is when we go to the park and so oh. we've been trying to do that more frequently lately um so they're not like 23 years old and they can't ride a bike uh, but we do have to get another bike for london uh, she still uses our train wheels, but there's something wrong with the tire. So maybe we don't really need a new bike. We just need a new, new tire. tire for London. But I'm sure it'll it'll all work out. Mm -hmm. But yeah, I will be back in just a minute. Hey, so we made it back home. Um, we've been out for a little while shopping, trying to find a few things for the pictures we're going to take tomorrow. I think I told you guys we're going to a tree farm um we really didn't find anything i think we found well we didn't really find anything for the outfits but um jordan did need a pair of black short boots so we found her some of those and then we did get aubrey and dad a shirt for the pictures tomorrow i hope it turns out okay it's um I don't know. I'm not really good at putting all this together. We are about to watch a movie. Um, I think we're watching it in Prince's room. Because he's now in the biggest room in the house. Um, and I, we brought out the projector. So we just have it shining on the wall. And this is like the first Christmas movie that we will be watching of the season. 
Um, so we just got finished eating dinner and I set up the t the projector and everything. So that's what we're about to do before we head to bed. I think we're watching Christmas Chronicles 2. It just came out this week. Um, and it's like two hours long. So we're definitely heading to bed when that goes off. And hopefully I'll be able to stay up and watch the whole thing. But yeah, that's what we're about to do. Um... Hopefully it's pretty good. I think it's pretty good. I saw like a little bit of the previews, but I haven't seen the entire thing. So we're going to check that out, head to bed, and then I will catch up with you guys tomorrow. And when he broke the final transgression, Bell Sickle was stripped of the joy of being an actor. Bell Sickle, what are you doing? Why would you do that? Because you can't. Good. Everyone's going to sleep. It's time. Oh, I can't wait to see what's going to happen in the hours because it's snooped full of this stuff. Oh, this is going to be fun. Good morning, you guys. We're on the road. So yesterday, I told you we um, watched a Christmas movie on the projector in um, Francis' bedroom. It was so nice. Uh, this is the first time we like stretched out the projection like we had it this far back and the screen was really really big so that was fun uh, next time we'll have to have more snacks but we had just eaten dinner and so we didn't have any snacks but next time I'll make sure we have the popcorn candy and get coke um, so we are headed to Finland Park I think it's in York South Carolina this will be our very first time going to get a Christmas tree where we actually cut it down ourselves uh, we've gotten real Christmas trees before, but we've never gone to the tree farm to cut them down. So that should be interesting. And it's a real hand saw. It's not like an electric or not electric. What's it called? It's not a chainsaw. It's a hand saw, I think. But I, I also, I think um, they supply the saw, so that's good. Hopefully they supply the rope and everything else that we need. But this should be fun. And we're actually meeting my sister and her husband. And Byron also invited one of his friends and their family. So we'll see if they make it. But it should be fun. I'm excited. This, Like I said, this is our first time. Hopefully the start of a new tradition. I like the feel of having a real tree. Byron doesn't like the mess of having a new tree. He doesn't like um, the sap. And the, the last time we had one, it's been a couple years since we had a real one, but it didn't have a lot of shedding or like pine cones all over the floor. I didn't think it was that bad, but he doesn't like the part where you're sticking it in the tree holder uh, because it's sticky. But and he doesn't mind getting served on his hands when he's eating pancakes, so I don't know what the big deal is. <laughs> but I will show you guys when we get there. It's like a two and a half hour ride. The kids are asleep. It looks like we're on a real road trip. I mean, it is kind of far, but they look like we're staying overnight. They got blankets and pillows and everything else. Uh, but I will come back on here once we get there. Okay, so y'all know the camera doesn't really do it justice. Oh, but it's doing pretty good, look. Okay, so we are here, Penland Christmas, Penland Tree Farm. We're at the very front, so you can see some of the trees, but these are not really the big trees. And we've been trying to take a couple pictures over here, but it's absolutely gorgeous out here. It feels so good. Uh, my sister, they brought their dog. We should have brought ours, but it's a little cramped having five, no, six people and two dogs in a seven-passenger car. So, is it seven? 
Yeah, it's a seven passenger car, so it's a little bit cramped, so we didn't do that. But this is fun. I think next year we might just go to the one closer to our house. That way the dolls can be with us. But it is really nice. Back up, baby. Back up, back up. Jackson, and he knows he's not They're going to try to get a picture. <laughs> Hold on. You said hold, on. hold on, please. Oh, no, Jack, on um, second dog, so maybe we out. won't bring the dogs. I'll get up, I'll get up, I'll get them all. Okay. <laughs> hold him up like this. Damn it! Yeah. Oh. Damn it! No one will hold him, Sean. We'll have to sit him up. So, apparently, they have a few, let's see, a few different things I'm trying to get better lighting. <laughs> this, nope, this. Can I hold the camera? You gonna talk to the camera? Okay, tell them what's going on. Guys, I'm um, gonna look at Guys, we are Wait. going to get us an axe. So we can cut the uh, yeah, they do, right there. So we can cut the sweet. No okay, so, so uh, um, I am going to get the axe. <laughs> I don't know where we get the axe. Your dad went to go get the axe. Oh, he went to get the axe. Yeah, he's already in line. Dad, where are we going now? Um, we are going over there. Over there? What do you see over there? I I see little mud. Uh, it's actually mulch. It's a pile of mulch. I see a pile of mulch. Yeah. We can maybe we can play in the afterwards. Oh, yeah, I see Christmas trees. You see Christmas trees? Yeah, and it's snow. This one, this one is a southern scotch. This is a mint Christmas mint cypress. Um, Christmas mint cypress. I like that. This one is nice, white pine. Get your brother's hand. Uh, this one is blue eyes. This is my least favorite. And then Leland Cypress. And they have all the candy canes on this one. A big crew in tow. About to come out this way. Hey, <laughs> Uh oh. Who is that? Friend? Are you trying to get your friend? Okay. Oh, where'd you go? Okay, a little bit. Oh, Dad's back there with two more girls. There's like eight kids out here with us. So we gotta walk a little slow, which is good because I feel them. So cute. I love. Oh, hey, y'all. I love it. I love it. So cute. All these little kids. Yes. The beautiful trees. Make you want some more. Wow. <laughs> wow. Well, they just gotta get some more ticks. What it do? Uh, I don't know. I might need a nanny. It is so nice out here. Like I said, this is our very first time 
trying to keep and I really didn't have the right shoes on for this but uh, it's not too hot but my feet do kind of hurt the terrain is a little hilly so it's okay though they're not horrible like they're the most comfortable boots slash heels that I have no actually they're not but they're still not that bad I'm trying to find out where the best lighting is but uh so you see how far we've walked and all of those trees are saved for next year and so the trees back this way where everybody else is those are the ones that we can pick from and i think we've decided to go with the christmas mint am i walking too slow they try and tell me to hurry up So I guess it is Christmas mint. That's what we're getting. He's right here. He's right here. I'll, Our, oh, we're gonna wait for the, him to get here. No, they go. They to go, go oh yeah. Oh, to choose. They all look about the same, huh? Yeah. So we're gonna get mint. I think it's pretty. Yeah. And it's different. So <clears throat> it looks like we found one tree. Well, my sister found her tree. What are you doing with that? She's making a wreath. Oh, okay. We're going to pick up some. They have free greenery, but we're going right, to pick up. Oh, that is so good. It's round around the bottom. This is a good one. It's not too big, not too small. It's the perfect one. Okay, so now we're on the hunt to find ours. Aubrey, that one's leaning over a little bit too much. You got to find one that's straight. Let's pick on that one. What's wrong with this one? I, I, I like this one right here, but I think, I think, I got, what about this? This is our first time. You don't like this one? This one. Oh, this one, yeah. And look, Byron, there's plenty of clearance for you to cut. But Daddy, we want to get a good one. I don't know, I feel like that one's too slim. Okay, we'll get this one. I like them slim, but get that one. I, I like that one. You like this one? What do you think? Chris, what do you think about this one, man? Arby, what do you think about this one? Jordan, you like this one? I don't know about this one. What do you think? I'm trying to lean on you. I guess. Oh. No, not really. Yeah. Why you don't like that one? It's that big one. <laughs> I like that one. At the top, it's a like little too skinny. Like that it's fine. I can shorten Sam. Short or Sam. Like one, though. Which one? Like what are these two boogers doing? Yeah. Let's see what these two boys. The only little boys well, out here. We can put this in the back like there. This right? is how we know which one is. But it's like, this one looks good. I just don't like this part. You don't like this one? Oh, you know. Nah, you don't That's the one I said. This Look at these kids. Look at them. Boys will be boys. Oh, I see it, man. I see it. Did you find a tree? Did y'all find a tree? What? Or y'all found yeah, some sticks? Yeah. You found a tree? They worried about these sticks. They are not worried about a tree. We got to leave that to this one and this one. London, did you like that tree over there? Is that yeah, the Get one em. your dad picked out? Okay, well, you got to find a tree. We got to find a tree. Oh. Okay, so it's our turn, and we are headed to cut our tree down. <laughs> Uh, Dad's gonna start. I think all the girls are gonna take a whack at it. See how much they can do. Oh, we got it. All right, Kalea.
They see each other like once a year. They're the cutest things in the world. And this is our plan. We got our tree. We got a little ways to walk. Let me get back over here in the grass. Um, we got a little ways. It's really not bad. I just wish I had a different pair of shoes, but it's all good. Oh, uh, yeah. isn't that beautiful? So pretty. Okay now, all the kids have gotten their marshmallows and chocolate, everything that they need for their s'mores. I was looking like a crazy person, I'm sure, but that's okay. That's what happens when you have eight kids with you. Um, but it's fun, I love it. Say hey, Candy. Hey, pretty girl. So, uh, we're just out here relaxing until they get the trees wrapped, and then we'll probably head out of here. I gotta keep my eyes on the kids, make sure nobody's getting burnt or taken. So I'll catch y'all in a little bit. This might be the last hayride of the season. Take that Like it feels so good out here. I've got eight kids 
sitting over here in the corner. Two lovebirds are here. But I'm sitting over here <laughs> in the corner with eight beautiful babies. I love it. It's crazy, but I love it. Always make me want another Only if it was a boy, but I'm not even going to say that. I'm done. Not saying that. 